Question 13. Liam has got two different sizes of rectangle. He's got a dark grey rectangle, which is 45 centimetres long, and he's got a light grey rectangle, which is 20 centimetres long. Let's see what we've got to do. It says he makes this pattern with them. So he's got two light greys, a dark grey, and then three light greys. Calculate the lengths of A and B. So you can see by the picture that A is this little gap here and B is this little gap here. So we've got to use the information of 45 and 20 for the two lengths to figure out what A and B are. Now, first thing I would do is I would be writing these measurements onto this diagram so I know what I'm dealing with. And you must not be afraid to do that. If ever you think it will make it easier to write lengths onto a picture, then do it because it will make it more obvious what you've got to do. So, we've got the dark grey one is 45, so this distance is 45, and we've got the short, the light grey ones are 20s, so we've got 20, 20, 20, 20, 20. Okay, so we're done with these diagrams now because we've already written the measurements on so what we can do is scroll down or we'll get a different color to make it less confusing so calculate the lengths of a and b now we can see that this distance here is the two twenties put together so that distance is 40 but from here to here is 45 because that's the length of the dark grey one so this little gap here must be the dis difference between 40 and 45 what do I add on to 40 to get to 45 nice and easy it's got to be 5 so A has to be 5 it's got to be there's nothing else that will make 40 add up to 45 what about B well, this distance is my three twenties put together. So 20, 40, 60. So those three together make 60. But I know that the dark grey one is 45. So this extra bit, 45 plus the extra bit, is the whole length, which we now know is 60. So what is the extra bit going to be added on to 45 to make 60? Well, if you can't do it in your head, you could just count up from 45 to 60. So plus an extra 10 would be 55, plus an extra 5 would be 60. So 10 and 5 makes 15. Looks like it's going to be 15. If, another way of doing it, it could be start with 60 and take off your 45. Okay, 0 take 5 you can't do. Carry the 1, 10 take 5 is 5, 5 take 4 is 1, so yes it is 15. So that bit has to be 15. So B, the length of B is 15. A quick double check, we're saying that A is 5. So 40 plus this 5 makes 45, so that works. And we're saying that B is 15. So 45 plus this 15 makes the same as these 320s, which is 60. So that works. But again, the key to this one is writing your measurements onto the picture to make it easier to look at.